Hey guys, just a reminder to check out vpntierlist.com. It's a collection of all my ratings on the channel, and you're going to find lots of helpful information here on how to choose a VPN. Anyways, back to the video. Hey, what is up guys? My name is Tom Spark. Welcome back to another video. Today we're talking about what are the best VPNs for security and privacy. Now you might be wondering, well, how did you figure out, you know, what is best for security and privacy? Well, it's a combination on my VPN tier list comparison table or the ratings for the VPNs themselves. It's a combination of the application, um, security and features combined with the reputation score. Combining these two things, you can find very secure and privacy conscious VPNs. So in this video, I'm gonna help you find out which VPNs are both secure in terms of features and an application, but also reputable in terms of having um, a good company history and not doing any sketchy things and so forth. All right, guys, let's check them out. All right, guys, so the first VPN I wanna talk about is AirVPN. Now, AirVPN has a very solid application. You know, it might look a little bit outdated with some weird kind of stroking coloring there, as well as kind of outdated look, but overall it's, a, you know, it works very well in terms of the interface, I think. But not only that, it's really got a lot of features to configure. As you can see here, there's so much configuration and customization you could do with it, really to make your VPN virtually um, unleakable and super secure. There's all sorts of DNS options, networking options, network lock options, and even more advanced things to configure. But not only that, VPN's company itself has a very secure privacy policy where they don't collect any logs. The company that is behind AirVPN is also very reputable. The forum community here is super transparent. Uh, moderators and AirVPN employees often explain exactly why they do certain things. The company itself even has admitted in the past they never pay for any reviews. So, you know, my opinion here is completely legitimate. And, uh, you know, pretty much most of the reviews about them are pretty honest. But that's really why you don't see them topping many reviews list because it has a low commission which means it's not you know bribing people with high commissions to rate them good but it's also not paying for reviews but in my opinion that makes them very reputable and it's definitely a very secure and privacy private vpn not only for the good reputation but as you saw before because of the excellent application next up on this list is going to be torguard vpn now torguard vpn's application is also very feature rich and customizable you can configure between OpenVPN and OpenConnect. OpenConnect is basically on Cisco AnyConnect and it's very secure and pretty good even as like a stealth VPN option. OpenVPN options here give you options to change the protocol, change the port in case OpenVPN is getting blocked as well as configure the cipher. Not only that, you have Stunnel and tons of other settings to configure here as well as you can see. Um, TorGuard's probably claim to fame is that they're one of the best streaming VPNs because you can integrate dedicated IPs as you see here how I've done. But besides that, they're not only good for streaming, but they're also very secure and private because their application is so powerful and feature rich. It really lets you um, take advantage of all these kind of features like application kill switch and it even has a network kill switch. And it's rare to see, you know, a lot of VPNs have both of these features. So very strong application. And just like AirVPN, TorGuard also has a very solid no log policy. They don't collect any logs from VPN use. And the company behind it is also very reputable and secure. It's been around for a while, just like AirVPN, and there's never been any leaks or any controversy about the mishandling user data or giving away information about users. And overall, it's a very transparent company as well, just like AirVPN. It doesn't claim it's based in some shell company. It's just honest about being based in the US. You could find information about their CEOs, the company itself, um, very easily just by searching uh, about them on Google. So that's one of my favorite things about the company and it's consistently gotten better and more secure over the years which is why it is one of the most secure, if not best VPNs overall. Very, very secure and private VPN is gonna be Molvad VPN. Now Molvad VPN is very secure in terms of how you create an account. Now AirVPN and TorGuard are also very secure in how you make an account and you could pay anonymously and use anonymous emails to sign up and everything like that so you don't have to give any information. But Molvad, it kind of makes it a little bit more intuitive by using an account system number. I think more VPNs could do this and it really gets it off to a good start. You can see here, you pretty much just go on the website, 
create an account number, add time to your account number, and that's, that's it. You don't even have to put a fake name. You don't have to pay really, you know, with any kind of credentials or make anything up. Now, again, is it really that much more secure? Mm, not really. You could use a similar anonymity, like I mentioned before, make fake names, use fake emails, pay with Bitcoin, so forth. But this just makes it really intuitive. And of course, you just paste your login number and you can log into the application. And now I don't have any time. Now, Movet VPN also has a very secure and private application as well. Is it as customizable in future rich as Air VPN and Tor Guard? Well, there might not be as many options, but it's still pretty secure and definitely easy to use. Um, you can enable IBV6, block um, disconnected, which is the kill switch, and it even has some stealth VPN options um, down here to bypass you know, VPN restrictions. Um, it's not gonna have too much uh, protocol customization besides just configuring open VPN. Uh, it's not gonna be just as customized, won't have as many settings to configure, but overall it's gonna get the job done and is pretty secure and private as well. But VPN is also excellent because they don't collect any logs. Um, and they're a very reputable company. They don't even have an affiliate program. So that means that most of the reviews about them are either too harsh or pretty honest. Overall, I do like them as a VPN provider. You know, they might not be as, you know, feature rich or customizable in terms of Air VPN and Tor Guard, just having a pure amount of settings, but you're still gonna get pretty good security. And again, that signup process is quite cool. So iVPN is also on there, another very strong VPN. I don't have an active subscription right now, so I'm having to use some previous footage of me checking out the application. Um, but it is a very se secure VPN, and just like the other ones, it has a lot of features and configurations to really make it secure. As you can see here, I was going over a lot of the features. You see here, there's a lot of connection options. It even has WireGuard support, which is not super secure yet, but it is cool to see them implementing these kind of new security features a little bit earlier on than some other you know, people out there. And they also have a lot of firewall options to configure some, um, as you can see here, lots of things. And um, overall, it's a very solid VPN. Uh, iVPN also does not collect any logs. You can find out that information here. And they also actually don't have an affiliate program as well, which is pretty interesting. A lot of these honest VPN providers that I've mentioned in this video either don't have affiliate programs or they have extremely low um, affiliate programs with low commissions, even TorGuard and AirVPN. Um, only have 30 and 20% commission rates, which makes honest reviews a more of a thing for these companies. But unfortunately, it also makes them get less re review content overall. Having these low commission rates, what happens is people don't feel as incentivized to push these VPNs to top rankings just because they have high commission rates. Unfortunately, since these VPNs have lower commission rates, other VPNs that have higher commission rates get better review scores and rankings on VPN review sites that aren't really that legit in my opinion. VPN area is another application and company that is very secure. The application has a tons of features to configure, as you can see here, um, quite feature rich, and lots of things to configure and play around with to make your VPN secure, just like some of the other options I already mentioned. The company itself does not collect any logs either, and it's a very reputable company. It's not in the news as much. It's probably not as popular as some of these other options, um, but nevertheless, it is also very secure and very good for your privacy. Anyways, guys, thanks for checking out this video about the most secure and private VPNs. By looking at a combination of the application and what security features you could get, as well as considering the privacy policy and the overall reputation of a VPN company, you yourself can easily also decide if a VPN is secure or not. Thanks for checking out this video, and I'll see you again on the next one very soon.